to my YouTube channel if you're new here. My name is Charlotte. Um, I'm so grateful to have you watching and you joining. Um, so this is just like a little weekly vlog of what I get up to. It is Monday today. Um, it is the 2nd of January 2023. So it is a bank holiday in the UK. So my parents aren't working or anything. Um, so it's been a little bit of a different day to normal as you will have seen from the little montage I did this morning. So we start the day with check-ins, um, which is normal business for a Monday. Um, and then we actually went out to breakfast. We had some family visiting um they stayed the night in the area so we went had like lunch with them yesterday and then we went for breakfast before they head off this morning which was really nice um we went to this really nice breakfast place um and yeah the food that is just so so good um and then yes yeah, so we came home well actually i did a food shop got myself sorted for the week um and then came home went on a dog walk and then i've just kind of chilled I've been home like half an hour, I think. Something like that, maybe longer. I don't know. Been home a little bit anyway, um, and just chilled because I was like, I came home from the dog walk and I was about to get into work, and I was like, oh my god, I feel like I've just not, I've not like sat down since I got up, and like actually just not done anything. Um, so I just chilled for a little bit. Um, I've got quite a lot to do this afternoon, actually. I, I kind of thought it was like earlier in the day and it was. And then I looked at the time and I was like, oh my God, it's actually nearly three o'clock. And I have a call at three o'clock. We have a team EDC um, monthly call. And obviously it's the start of the year. It's like an exciting one. So team EDC is the coaching company. That Well, company? I don't know if you'd describe it as that it's like the coaching team that i work with um so yeah setting some goals and everything for the year ahead um so that is the plan for the rest of the day i've got some client calls this evening to do some kind of goal setting for the year um and yeah it's an exciting one so i'm gonna do a weekly vlog um my goal is that i really want to get into the habit of weekly vlogging again i love it i did like one vlog in october november time um and then i fell off the bandwagon so the goal is to get consistent with them again i think like i just need to edit each day like of an evening i need to of an evening i need to edit the whole of that day and then just go through the week like that because it's the editing that i lose with because i leave it until a sunday and then i'm trying to get like a video edited like completely edited a thumbnail done and uploaded and all my normal work and it just doesn't work so we're gonna try the week like the daily editing and we're gonna see how that goes um but yeah so that is everything for me for now but yeah busy afternoon so i probably to be honest i probably won't speak again i'll probably just keep up with the montages i feel like people like montages I don't really know. I feel like when I'm watching vlogs, I like the montages. Um, and yeah, today is a rest day as well, so I'm not training. Um, I trained legs on, oh wow, there's like a little plane thing. Interesting. Um, I trained legs on Saturday after having a little bit of time away from training. And then I went for a run yesterday. Um, at some point in this video, I'm gonna sit down and talk about like my goals and stuff for the new year, but not right now, because I just do not have the time. Um, see so yeah, i went for a little bit of a run yesterday and oh my lord i hurt so much i'm so sore my back is really sore from doing rdls on saturday and then my calves and hips are just in agony from running yesterday because i've not run in years so my body is not used to it um so i have some getting used to that to do <laughs> um but yeah rest day today um and yeah i need to finish this little chat here otherwise i'm not gonna get anything done but yeah i will probably speak to you maybe this evening maybe tomorrow um but yeah enjoy the rest of this video please like comment and subscribe and yeah thanks for watching i guess and thanks for continuing to watch the rest of this video oh my god i'm so not with it hello happy tuesday is my phone gonna stay there can you even see my head hopefully um so yeah happy tuesday um it's half past ten 
today's not got off to a successful start i had the absolute worst night's sleep last night um i couldn't sleep i was overthinking everything i got an something i found is um when i have a really busy day i get like really overstimulated and then i basically like just can't sleep and that is basically what happened last night um so i obviously just gave myself a little bit longer in bed this morning i was meant to get up at six but i was like not getting up at six and i didn't get to sleep till one especially because i was waking up through the night like that would just be silly um so like it would be silly when i have the flexibility to not do so obviously like obviously when you're in a corporate job and stuff i understand that you obviously have to just get up and get in like or if, not even just a corporate job when you're in a job where you don't work for yourself um but yeah i decided to just spend a little bit longer in bed then i had to book my car in for an mot because i fucked up and i didn't check when my mot was due and it is due on friday um obviously yesterday was a bank holiday so not being ideal but they managed to get me in on thursday so that is awesome um but yeah i need to start check-ins i'm ho i just want to wake up a little bit before i get into check-ins i really don't like doing check-ins when i still feel half asleep i don't feel like people get my best qualities um or like they don't get the most out of them so yeah I'm, i've got a coffee um i've had some breakfast i had a protein mousse um like what i had yesterday um and then this morning because i was up a little bit later um and everyone was at work because it's not my holiday i made a green smoothie um which was uh, really really nice well i've still got it it is quite nice i had to add extra pineapple into it though because oh my god they do not like with those pre-made like a smoothie packs that you can blend yourself like the frozen ones they do not get the green to race to like sweet fruit ratio right even with the fruit juice so we have to add some extra pineapple um but yeah plan for the day is check-ins i have a call with a client at 12 um and then yeah it will be more check-ins dog walk i really want to go to the gym today and i might have to go i might have to go during peak time peak time 3rd of january but i'm not just not gonna go like because normally i would be like wow i don't want to get peak time so we'll have today as a rest day but no i'm gonna just, i'm just gonna make myself go because i know like i'm wanting to go to the gym again so we're just gonna do it um if that's how it works out because i've got a call at five till half five and then another call at eight so that does give me enough time to go to the gym and have a meal and that's probably the only gap that i have today that i will be able to fit the gym in with because i've woken up late um but yeah instead of talking about the day let's just get into the day um it was not the first day but it's a new day we're moving forward i have done check-ins it's like 12 o'clock i'm about to go to the gym i just thought i could show you what i'm wearing so i got this really cute jump up from this company um it's called sunday dream um and the jumper is a taylor swift one um from the song the lakes it's my absolute favorite song so had to be done um so yeah i've got this jumper on it's like a nice really dark brown color i thought it was black but i actually really like how dark brown it is i think it look really nice with brown leggings and also mocha color amplifiers um so yeah and then speaking of amplifiers i have my amplifiers on this is the color peer blue peer, yeah peer blue um obviously nike socks and my blazers that i have had for like a year now which is insane um and then bra wise it is the amplify no not amplify alphalete tri bra but yeah i am just heading off to the gym now um plan is to train i'm gonna try and get a short session i just want to do like 45 minute sessions i'm gonna speak to my coach about changing my sessions to four 45 minute ones 
because I'm really struggling with finding the time for training at the moment or, or making the time for training at the moment. I just don't, it's not my top priority. My top priority is work. So yeah, um, but yeah, I need to go to the gym. Otherwise I am gonna keep blabbing and not make it. But yeah, I will speak soon, I hope. <laughs> I have just got back from the gym and had a little bit of lunch i had the i actually went to the food warehouse um and i got the new my protein i can take my shoes off i got the new my protein meals um and today i had the chicken tikka wrap it's really good i would really recommend um it's a little bit expensive but for the ease of it it was really good um so much easier than cooking and the macros are so good it was like 38 grams of protein um which is perfect obviously um i'm not tracking currently but um i'm still keeping an eye on like my protein making sure that i am eating enough um and everything like that because i always want to make sure we are fueling our body um but what was i saying but yeah it is really nice um and i got a few different ones of them i'm gonna put my phone down i think you'll be able to see me i hope you'll be able to see me um so yeah i got a few different ones so they'll be nice to kind of have and try um and yeah but anyway, um, I went to the gym and trained up a body um, and I just put a hair mask in my little bun um, because I'm gonna wash my hair um, this evening at some point, I don't know. I feel like I have loads to do, but like, you know, you're fully scattered about it. Um, but yeah, plan right now is to do I've got like some little tasks that need doing um so i'm gonna crack on with those and then i will go for a walk before it gets dark because i've still got how many steps do i need to do um i've got like three thousand steps to do so i'm it won't be a long walk but i just need to get something in um i might try and go a bit be a, a, like a bit above my step goal um because i didn't do steps yesterday and I got 10,000 on Monday. So if I get like 10,000 today, it's like the equivalent of I did my steps yesterday. So, um, but yeah. Sorry, my brain isn't working. So I'm just gonna finish this little segment here because no one needs to see me umming and ahhing for any longer. Um, but yeah, I will speak to you in a little bit when I have a bit more to say. so it's now sunday this video i've edited most of it already and i realized that like it's been so all over the place so i'm really sorry about that obviously just kind of getting into the habit with youtube i just forget about it obviously i've not really done anything since wednesday i just kept forgetting it's been a crazy crazy week um but yeah i wanted to kind of flush this video out a little bit more and obviously at the start i did say that i would talk through what my goals are for this year so i kind of just wanted to do that now so i don't i'm not really working towards any crazy aesthetic goals this year and that is something that like i really want to focus on and just not having crazy aesthetic focuses um because it's something i have kind of focused on the last few years um obviously it's a, like 2020 i wanted to oh, well, 2019 i wanted to lose weight 2020 i wanted to lose weight 2021 i wanted to gain muscle 2022 i wanted to gain muscle um and i do feel like i'm like i'm happy with i'm, I'm somewhat happy with the progress that i've made in terms of gaining muscle but i also feel like constantly having that as a goal has put like loads of pressure on myself i don't know um but yeah, I feel like it makes me not as happy with the final result. So this year I want to focus more on the processes that go into achieving that goal. Um, so that, yeah, I will still achieve that end goal. I will still gain muscle. Gaining muscle is like my number one goal. Um, I really want to build my legs way more. Um, obviously, like, I, I do have larger glutes. Um, so I kind of want to just flush my, like, fl build my legs out so that everything is a lot more, like, in sync and looks... I don't know what the right wording is for it but yeah so obviously gaining muscle is still a big goal but i'm mainly focusing on the processes around that um so 
really big one for me at the moment is to make sure that I'm consistent with my training again kind of the back end of this year hasn't been super super consistent work's been a big priority which is awesome love that but I want to make sure that I'm getting to my training in so I have come down to four training sessions that are going to be about 45 minutes each um so that should make it a lot more manageable i'm gonna try and make sure that those training sessions are of a morning so i had wanted to have like a really nice morning routine and start work nice and early but once i'm in work i find it really really difficult to pull myself out of it i get very overwhelmed um so i think it makes so much more sense for me to go to the gym of a morning do some steps on the treadmill at the same time so i can just go for a shorter walk um throughout the day basically so that is something that i'm going to be incorporating um and then kind of other fitnessy goals are i'd really like to start running again to help with my anxiety i have set the goal of one run a week i'm not sure like i wanted sunday to be run day um, I had a call at 9am this morning, so with it getting, it doesn't get light now until like 8, so I just didn't really have the time to go before. I don't live by those street lights, I live in the middle of nowhere, so like I have to go when it's light. Um, I'm hope I'll hopefully I'll fit it in this afternoon maybe, instead of going for a walk, I'll just go like run it. Um, but yeah, we'll see. I don't want to put too much pressure on that goal, I want it to feel very like organic. Um, that's like a really important thing for me this year, is not putting loads of pressure. Um, so yeah they're the kind of main goals i'm working towards and then a lot of the other things that i want to focus on are more like holistic i guess um so making sure that i'm journaling i recently got this journal i had been using the five minute journal on my ipad before um and i wanted to put like a really nice nighttime routine and make sure i was doing it of an evening but i just don't i don't know it's not that i don't enjoy journaling of an evening i feel like my evening routine i very much like to be more I'm a bit more social, like I spend time with my family, um, and then like I just read before bed, I don't really, I don't know, it just wasn't, it wasn't for me, I wasn't vibing with it. So I saw this in Asda, it was like £13, I was like, I'm just gonna give it a go, um, and I'm really enjoying it, I really like how it is structured, I like the fact that the questions are kind of different every day, this sounds like an ad, it's absolutely not an ad, <laughs> um, that would be insane. Um, so yeah, I want to start, make sure I'm journaling taking the 80 20 approach with my nutrition so i'm not tracking at the moment um decided to just take a little bit of a break from tracking um there's no kind of big reasons in particular kind of just found like become quite dependent on tracking to make sure that i was eating enough um and eating in the right way um i had a couple of days off of tracking and i realized like oh my god this isn't like the way i eat when i'm not tracking isn't right so a really big focus for me is just making sure that like when i'm not tracking i am still fueling my body properly eating okay um prioritizing protein and everything like that and on the flip side as well obviously having some time with intuitive eating and not tracking can that let me help my clients that don't track a lot more like i can really help them um yeah with kind of not tracking and having that more intuitive focus and guide them a lot more um i definitely big fan of like making sure that you walk the walk um and guiding people through things that you yourself have experienced i think that will really really help um and then kind of my other goals for the year or like keeping my room clean is a big one because i don't like making content when my room isn't clean and like focusing on content is something that i really really want to do this year so that is obviously like an important one um and then also reading so may as well hold a book while i talk about this so my goal is to read at least 12 books this year i've technically already read one i did start in like last year i started in december but i'd finished most of it when i uh, no i finished i i hadn't finished most, i finished most of it this year i was like 100 pages in by new year's so i've taken that as i've read a book this year already so i'm on to my next book and i'm trying to read every day so for during the week i try and just read before bed um i have a lumi alarm clock that does a sunrise i know a sunset it does a sunrise also but it does a sunset so i try and like put that on for half an hour i put my little like moonlight on um to give me a bit of extra light for like the full half an hour um and i just read for half an hour whilst i am falling asleep but yeah i found that that has been a really really good habit to keep um and it really helps with my sleep I find it very enjoyable it's like a nice form of escapism um 
but yeah those are kind of my main goals for the year i feel like they're not exciting oh my god also the other goal is i am going to be doing a photo shoot this summer definitely like it's something i've really wanted to do so i will be my goals are going to kind of change quite a lot throughout this year so i will have a time where like my focus is actually on getting lean which is crazy i've done mini cuts but i've not done like a proper big cut for a really long time but yeah that's exciting and obviously as when i get to that like i will focus content around that i'll do more like prep vlogs prep um but yeah that is everything from my goals um and guess i'm just gonna wrap this video up here so i have time to finish editing it and get it out today as it's sunday um but thank you so much for watching i know this hasn't been like the most thrilling vlog ever i'm gonna get so much better um if there is anything that you want to see please let me know i would love to talk about stuff especially like work gym everything like that i'm gonna be brave and take my tripod to the gym next week i guess i'm doing early sessions so I'm gonna grow a pair and take my tripod and try and film some bits um i'm not gonna film like full workouts i don't really know um with it being january i know there's a lot of new people in the gym i don't want to make anyone feel uncomfortable um but yeah cool thank you so much for watching this video um i would absolutely love it if you could like comment and subscribe if you've made it through this far through this video comment a book emoji so i know that you're a real one um but yeah thank you so much for watching and i will speak to you next week <laughs>